mattine saranno recitate da alcune The prayer donne. marathon requested by Pope Francis to ask for an end to the pandemic will continue throughout the month of May and virtually connect Christians in different parts of the world. Abbiamo ricevuto una mail da An evangelical pastor and her community sent us a message saying they would participate in the rosary will be reciting at 6 p.m. This means the pandemic unites us not only in the hardships but also in this communal prayer that transcends our differences. Archbishop Rino Fisichella oversees the Pontifical Council for promoting the new evangelization, responsible for organizing the event. He says the prayer marathon will be the church's cry for help during these difficult pandemic months. This response has two objectives, to ask God for an end to the pandemic and for help returning to our normal lives. That's why we invited all the sanctuaries in the world to join us in this moment of prayer. Thirty sanctuaries, a different one each day in May, will lead the rosary prayer in the evening, Rome time. There are no limits to who can join. From the Basilica of Guadalupe in Mexico, the Sanctuary in Lourdes, France, and the Shrine of Our Lady of Charity of El Cobre in Cuba, to Chestakova in Poland, and even the Shrine of Medjugorje, which in 2019 Pope Francis recognized as a pilgrimage site. As inspiration for this prayer marathon, we chose a verse from the Acts of the Apostles. Prayer by the Church was fervently being made to God. The Church prayed because Peter was imprisoned, and today the world is imprisoned, imprisoned by a virus, by loneliness. The Pontifical Council for Promoting the New Evangelization has prepared material for the event in many different languages, available on their website.